Hello, Wendy, Spanish Crafter here. I'm back again to show you another little notebook that I've made to go in the fundraising box at the charity shop to raise some funds for the dog centre, rescue centre, where we got our Rico from. This one is following a tutorial by um, Natasha Treasure Books on YouTube. And it was made from one piece of 12 by 12 card and it's made into like a little double notebook folio. It's quite small. It's um, 16 centimetres by nine, but it houses quite a lot really. So I've put one of GK's word sentiments on the front, just a little pocket there. These I've had for years in my stash, I'm not sure where they're from, and I just stapled some lace on the top as a little tag top. And inside there's two notebooks. Now I've just fastened these in with elastic. I've not I've stitched them as a signature but not actually stitched them into the folder so that you can take them out when they're finished or take them out to write in. And I've put little transfer stickers on the front. The same here. Now the way the 12 by 12 is folded, you just nearly fold it in half, but you leave one or two centimetres. So that gives you pockets. So in that pocket, I've just put a plain piece of card and put one of the transfer stickers on the top. These are from Tracy Fox's mini tag kit. And these are Artie May's butterflies. So it's just coffee dyed paper and some are ink cartridge dyed and here's the pocket and I've put two tags in that I've made in those pockets and these are like side loading tags and I've just done a mini envelope and a little journaling card there made out of some scraps of paper that were left and they just slot into the side of the tag. And this, the top of the tags is an old bed sheet torn up. <laughs> What's that the same one? Oh yeah, book. And this one is the same, a little mini envelope with an image on the front from G Care. As you can tell, I buy a lot of G Cares. <laughs> ephemera kits and these I think these little labels and stamps were from Artie Mays and these are G Care again and these little words are a freebie from Victoria Designs and they just slot into the back there and the same there I've not put any anything in the pages so if you're giving one of these to somebody, not everybody quite understands junk journals. So I think, well, they can use them just as a notebook. And just on this back page is a little journal tuck. And I, make, I love making these just out of scraps of paper that you have left. Fold over the top. And I've put a, punched some circles and stuck it halfway and then the little flat tucks behind it and stuck a gem on top and I think that makes quite a nice gift and it all just folds together I put an eyelet in with some seam binding from Crafty Ribbons and that just ties together tie it in a bow so that's another one to go in the box at the craft shop to hopefully raise some more money for the animals thank you for watching please give us a thumbs up and subscribe that'd be lovely and i shall see you next time bye